Hi everyone, welcome back to another one of my videos. It's Michelle here. And in today's video, we're going to be looking at all of the super bomb, super lit, super delicious and yummy and amazing food that I either made or ate during Thanksgiving weekend. So without further ado, let's hop into it. For Thanksgiving this year, I made my mini quesadilla rolls as an appetizer. These are super easy to make and super yummy. In order to make them, essentially, first you're going to chop up some chicken breasts or chicken tenders um, and fry them up in a pan like this. Then I added some onions, cooked them until they were a little bit translucent, added some pinto beans and black beans, also added some corn. These are all the taco seasonings that I got, but essentially I only used two. These are the two that I used. Added the taco seasoning in and mixed it on up. Add water if you need to, just to get it to the consistency that you want. I was short on time, so I picked up some cilantro lime ready rice. Here's my little setup, assembly line, if you will. So I have the tortillas, the cilantro lime rice, the cheese, and the quesadilla mixture. To assemble, you have the tortilla, add the cheese, a little bit of rice and then the quesadilla mixture make a bunch of them line them up in a pan and you got something like this top them off with cheese bake them in the oven until they're crispy and the cheese is melted and you have something like this these were super good don't forget the sour cream and the salsa as a topping on the side and i am definitely going to make these again and highly suggest for dessert, I made these gooey blondies. I really just used a mix. Again, this is one of my favorite mixes to use. It's Lily Bean by Pastry Base. And I added some chocolate chunks. Again, I just really chopped up some Dove chocolates that we had laying around. And this is how they came out. These are so bomb, guys. I forgot to take a video of them cut up, but I'm going to insert a picture now. I'm telling you guys, you really have to try these out. They're so good. All right, on to Thanksgiving dinner. My cousin made these super bomb stuffed mushrooms. And also my aunt made this also super bomb sushi bake. This was also so good. All right, so for dinner we had a lot. So we had spare ribs, puto, dinuguan, Louisiana shrimp, bonsit, ham, Sisig. We got stuffing, of course, the turkey. We have the mashed potato bar. We have some glazed carrots. This is my brother's award winning adobo. It got a little steamy, but please hold. I'll have a clip later. All right. It's too steamy. My God. We got some sweet potato casserole corn casserole and the table full of desserts yum here's the turkey before it got cut up and everything you know looking all cute and stuff here's my brother's award-winning adobo and of course the sago so good so bomb the Friday after, I also had my high school friend group's annual Friendsgiving that we always have. It's usually a dessert party, so here's all of the yummy and delicious desserts that we ate. And we usually just catch up and everything, and I look forward to it every year. This weekend, I also tried this biscuit-topped chickpea pot pie soup. So first, I just sauteed some celery, carrots, and onions, and some butter. Then I made a roux, so I added some flour in there. I didn't have any chicken stock on hand, but I used the Better Than Bouillon, which looks like this. I swear it tastes way better than it looks, so I just mixed a little bit of that with water. Added some chickpeas in. Lola added in some peas. Then I mixed everything up until it got into this kind of consistency, pretty much like a chicken pot pie soup consistency. 
Then I top them with biscuits. I just use the Pillsbury Grand's flaky layer ones from the can. I think I use the Hawaiian roll ones and bake them as instructed. And it came out like this. This actually ended up tasting super, super yummy. I might make some tweaks uh, if I make it in the future, but it otherwise, for the first time making it, ended up really, really good. All right, guys, that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and seeing all of the yummy food I either made or ate during this Thanksgiving weekend. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. I hope you have a great rest of your day wherever you're watching. And until next time, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.